The views and opinions expressed on any program are those of the persons appearing on the program and do not necessarily reflect the views and opinions of Sunflower Media Mint. Some programs might include strong images or language that not might be suitable for all audiences. Viewer discretion is advised. What can you do with 30 minutes? For us, we define things. Straightforward. New perspectives. No gray area. It is black and white. You're listening to the new You Podcast. Back to the pod on a Thursday evening, 9th of July. The new podcast live at Facebook Live. Uh, you can catch us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube, just about anywhere in social media. And of course, you can download the previous episodes on Spotify, Apple Podcasts, and Google Podcasts. Uh, for tonight's episode, this is episode 23. Of course, it's Thursday, so we have Gita on the pod tonight. Hi, Gita. Welcome again. Hi. This is Gita's second episode with the gang. Of course, Reg. Reg, with... What's your Ellie. Ellie. Reg with Ellie. Oh my god. Wait, I'm going to say hello. Say hello. <laughs> Hi, Ellie. Okay. Um, well, this is going to be... Um, what do you call this? The past year. We're going to talk about streetwear for tonight. The new streetwear. Of course, our guest for this evening. Uh, yung isa na guest na sa amin with you, mude. Eh. But the other one, this is the first time on the pod. So, welcome back, Dara, on the pod. And of course, welcome, Hi. Hannah Ichiko. Hi, guys. Hello, hello, everyone. <laughs> hey, guys. <laughs> so, the, the, this is Happy Tea, this is UPT. Like what we always say, since andito si Gita, kaya nagiging happy tea pag Thursday. Kasi so, kilala yan bilang trainer ng happy teas ng TAF. So, happy tea. Ah, hindi na ngayon. Happy tea is going to be different with, with how we do the pod every day, now and then. Happy tea is more of, well, yung tradition na yun, it's more of an inuman session. Uh, more of an inuman type lang. So, it's an open discussion. Then, like the the OG pod, wherein we talk about uh, with a subject matter expert on the topic. But for this one, well, we gathered the crew here with Dara and Hannah to talk about the streetwear. But first, kumusta kayo? Kumusta kayo dalawa? Like kanina, Dara. Well, guys, for those tuning in right now, na delay kami. Sorry talaga. Sorry naman. Pero it's not intentional. We we got delayed because we got a fire alarm. Oh, sorry. <laughs> so, how was that? How was that? We had to go down and wait for it to stop. Yeah. Like start because it's a big building and then like the moon is getting young. I don't know if it's they did it on purpose or what. So it's been about ten minutes. So we had to oh, go no. down. Did not stress your cat. Yeah. But it's not like it's like Loki covered with my mask. <laughs> That's so stressful at this hour, pa. Ha? <laughs> eh, wala ka magagawa dun. Hannah, ikaw, kamusta? Kamusta ang quarantine? I mean, this is, first, this is the first I'm episode okay. for Hannah on the pod. So, how are you? How are you? I'm okay. I'm okay. How about you guys? Just came home from the grocery. I was running out. But, ah, oh, believe. <laughs> Kasi, it's kind of like traffic na sa labas. Bumabalik yeah, the na traffic is getting traffic. worse na. Mm-mm. Yeah, it is. Uh, I, I mean, home. it's GCQ na eh. Well, we'll find out on the 15th talaga kung ano mangyari sa bansa natin. But I mean, sa bansa natin. <laughs> I mean, yeah, if I, whenever I would go out, parang wala din eh. The traffic on a regular day or even on the days when you wouldn't expect traffic, no? Parang, wow, yeah. nandun pa rin. Yeah. <laughs> it's still the same. Mm-hmm. Well, fun fact, this is How? the first time that I know this is the first time that I went back to the office for a long time. So it's about, about four months yeah, time I work from home now. And then right now we're slowly yeah. returning oh, back yeah. to the office once a week. So <clears throat> Ang hassle ganina. I was also rushing <laughs> like, back because it's it's about seven o'clock plus plus and then uh, we have the show at eight. But yeah, all worth it. I mean <laughs> uh we're still live right now and uh, of course. And well, for first, well, good evening, Jason. Well, Jason is a friend from Bounce Back, so hi, 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 there, man. Uh, we're going to launch something with Bounce hey, Back. Jason. We're going to launch something with Bounce Back, actually. Uh, I think next week, something like that. So watch out for that. But 
Okay. Ikaw, Gita, kamusta? Kasi once a week ka lang namin nakakamusta eh. So, kamusta ka naman? <laughs> okay, okay naman. I had a very relaxing day and ending it with you guys, of course. <laughs> ano ginawa mo today, Gita? Secret. Nagpa-therapy ako sa lower back ko. Yeah, wow. but naman. All good. Good to hear, good to hear. Okay, the new streetwear. Okay, what about streetwear? Okay, lately we've been all going out. It's GCQ, but as we all know it, uh, it's not safe out there. Okay? So that's the reason why we see people outside, well, very different from from how we see people. I mean, you go out and mm-hmm. then suddenly we wake up na masks are already mandatory. I mean, uh, usually when we go out, you, you see the whole face of, 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 of a person and then right now, uh, you see everyone wearing masks. It's really that mm-hmm. important. And with the streetwear right now, brands are also coping up. We uh, the start nung GCQ, uh, uh, ECQ, I think, Nike made this uh, announcement that some of their productions for shoes they're converting it to to mask, and the rest followed. Mm-hmm. So so yeah, with with the streetwear, I mean with with Dara and uh, Hannah, you guys, well before everything happened, how are you? Usually, naman you see Dara and Hannah playing in their gigs and then of course mas mas streetwear tong dalawang to eh. that's the reason why we invited yeah. them on the show I mean you can check out their Instagrams you can check out how they dress up and all how streetwear for you guys how 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 does streetwear how is it defined by Dara and Hannah um Hannah first um streetwear for me is really comfy parang yun yung yun yung ideal ko na gusto kong suotin like almost every day kasi we feel like comfortable when it comes to like gigs kasi medyo mainit sometimes di ba lagi kaming outdoor so we have to move it yeah. pag naka streetwear kasi it doesn't mean like parang medyo sinasabi na like male male type daw pag um, streetwear but it's not true I mean ako gustong gusto ko like kaming dalawa ni Dara lagi kaming matchy Pero no. streetwear yung ano niya. Yeah, we don't even talk about it. Uh, sometimes we don't oh, even wait. talk about it. Parang, uy! <laughs> same ha? Pero like different color. But the same like streetwear na naka... Usually, yun yung gusto namin i-portray as like parang branding for our um for Skittles. Mm-hmm. And yeah, it's, e- it's easiest to pair with anything rin kasi like with street, like yeah, baggy clothes. You can just wear a baggy clothes and then anything na lang na shorts you don't even have to decide which shorts because it's gonna be covered up anyway and then so with the shoes na lang comfy shoes so kami ni Hannah every time we have like out of town gigs we're always wearing like loose shoes talaga and uh, shoes na lang because it's easy pag especially sa airport it's so comfy yeah na, ano na or sometimes um yeah baggy hoodie or Yung sa mga sports bread then um, when it comes to gigs, streetwear, street or sports where we mix it, mix and match it. Mm-hmm. So baggy pants and then yeah, we jack top. pants. Or yun, yeah. Ka, ano lang. <coughs> Excuse me. Well, I think it's comfortable. Eh. It's it's like the most comfy because, state talaga. Eh. For me, kasi personally, hindi yeah. din kasi ako girly girl. So I really hate we- heels. I really hate having to wear heels. I cannot walk in heels. Kahit yung mga flats, medyo uncomfortable talaga ako. I prefer like sneakers lang din talaga. Same. Gita, ikaw, kamusta? Ay, si madam, nag-heels yan sa office palagi. <laughs> Actually nga, ito nga, I'm like the total opposite. As in, you guys, like, streetwear for me has so much style. As in, sana, me kasi, since I'm... I can't wear so much baggy clothes. Kasi, alam mo yun, mas mag mumuha akong doble. <laughs> <laughs> so, hindi siya, so, mas, mas okay pag fit yung sa akin, ah. Mm. Kaya, parang, whenever I see people who have so much style, sobrang, yeah. I, I really look up to your style, guys. As in, it's really nice. And you carry it so well. 
Galing. Pero, pero iba din talaga yung style mo, Gita. Like, sa office pa lang si Gita. I, Gita's the, the girl that always wears a lot of dresses and girly then girl. heels. Girly girl. Tapos minsan nagtataka ako kasi minsan mag-aangkas lang yun eh. Paano siya sumasakay sa akin? Oh, Paano siya kay Kuya? Paano siya kay Kuya? Dejo, secret ko naman. <laughs> Talent. Post. Ito mo your talent. Oh, mag-angkas po nang nakadress. Dejo. Bali ko rin. It never, parang, parang nakapants nun sa office, palagi kang nakadress or nakahills, yeah. ganun. Fridays ka lang ata nakapants kapag casual eh. Yeah. Kaya nga eh, like streetwear is something na I really want to carry for myself then. Kaya, Galing, galing how you guys do it so effortlessly. As yeah, you. it saves time as well. Like you don't have to, you know, put a lot. You know, okay, yeah. once you like put streetwear, just add a bit of accessory, and then you're good to go. Na yeah, that's true. And it's yeah, and it's so simple, lang. As in, you don't mm-hmm. even have to think so much pa on what to put on. As in, as yeah. long as you know it looks good, okay, na yan. Very, very, very Ito, very isa pa yan. Isa pang yan. Ito si Harley. <laughs> Streetwear yan sa office, eh. <laughs> kahit, may, kahit may memo na na, ano eh, bawal na kamaong, bawal na ka, bawal na ka rubber shoes. And then, I mean, uh-huh. kidding, kidding aside. Baseball shirt pa yan, eh. Nagbe-baseball shirt. <laughs> Pumasok na ka-baseball shirt. Pero right now, like, like, like you know, this is based on, well, what's happening right now. I went to the office on slippers, sandals, and hmm. I mean, bumalik ko yung slippers outside. So I think one thing na well, medyo 90s, of course 90s. Uh socks, socks on sandals. It's happening yeah. again. Yeah. Because. And slides. Yeah, on slides. Yeah, socks on slides. Yes. So, kasi, <laughs> Wala kang magagawa eh. I mean, if you go out, I mean, lalo na for those who are actually commuting, if you go out and then on sandals or slippers, and then, alam naman natin yung dumi sa labas pa rin. Pag mo sa office, sobrang dumi na lang paamo, di ba? So, you don't have any choice. So, of course, you have to bring extra socks and all, di ba? For, for at least, uh, y- yun yung the usual mo. And like like us, of course, the, the shoes is asked to be left outside the office. Yeah. Because for for sanit uh, sanitize yung bong office, because carpet eh. so you have to leave the shoes outside, and then you have to wear slippers na pang loob lang na opisina namin. So the, I think th- those are the things right now, uh, and and it goes with the office wear, okay? Because it, it's really going to be different eh. uh, at this point in time where in uh, safety is going to be first. Uh, the clothing will follow. And I've, I've seen uh, some of the businesses also right now, the ones creating <clears throat> leather shoes, they're creating slippers already. Na closed. Closed yeah. slippers. They may mga tazel pa rin, same thing like that. Para yung convenience hmm. talaga, yung comfy na you have to remove your shoes, hindi na hassle, natatanggalin mo pa. And all. Yeah. So a lot, a lot is really changing right now at this time. And and like what I mentioned with one of the, the episodes, uh, in this pandemic, for two months now, we've been talking about the negativity of it. What's what's happening, yung, yung negative side lang. But, for some people that uh, we can actually look into, they are seeing opportunities in, in, in this pandemic. And I think that's something that most of us should actually look into. Like the streetwear style, diba? Right? If you are into this type of business, you have to capitalize it because everyone will adapt. You, you don't yeah. want to go out mm-hmm. there wearing the usual office attire, long sleeve, slacks, and all, tapos naka-slippers ka. Diba? Sobrang, ewan ko. <laughs> Mas hindi natin maintindihan yun. Naka-suit ka, tapos naka-slippers ka. Parang tabo. But anyway, uh, okay. Streetwear also. Um, You guys are into this brand thing. What do you call this? Scoop? Scoop. Scoop. Yeah, oh, yeah. Yes. Brand ambassador of Scoop. Can okay, can you share more about Scoop? Um, they started three years ago, palang now. So they're a mix of local and Japanese influence with all mm-hmm. their designs. So, we're me and Hannah are ambassadors from Scoop. So yeah, mm-hmm. and yeah, we, they 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 have 
They have almost everything na babe, no? Um, jersey, yeah. hoodies, um, bucket hats, tapos bucket socks, hat. they, they sell, yeah. Feeling ko next um, na pants. I have one of their <laughs> bucket actually, hats yeah. here din eh. Where, oh wow, it's reversible pa. So, you, yeah. you don't get out of style, diba? Pag, nare, <laughs> um, I'm wearing like plain or ano. Like, Kasi sorry. mustard shirt. Well guys, since it's black and white, diba? So, bali ito yung parang mustard yellow side. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> It's really nice. <laughs> Tapos, this one's red and black. Alam ko, hindi nyo makikita kasi black and white to. Basta describe ko yung pulay, ha? <laughs> <laughs> I it's think really they nice partner with the new era. Yung, ano, yeah. Or, uh, yeah. New era. No, no. Bucket hat as like, well. Parang nakipag-collab yata or something. Mm-hmm. Collaborate. So, yeah, parang nakipag-collaborate din sila with other street to wear brands. Kasi nga, yun nga, like the most easiest and comfiest to go to clothes, especially yeah. now, and you can add on, like, you have to be covered, diba? Like, it's it's the so style good. na pwede mong, pwede mong again, without looking to be, like, without overdoing it. Like, yeah. With other, if you wear dress and then with the yeah. mask and big, I know. True, true. So. Mm. Ano din eh, I know, Notice also actually, sa tao lang, because I I really I really like bucket hats for me because I really think they're cute, they're quirky, they're fun. Pero kasi ngayon yung nat natawa ako kasi the other day when I was doing groceries at the mall, they came up. I, I'm pretty sure you guys have seen this. Kaya sa FB marketplace meron yung bucket hat na may face shield. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> transparent. And I, it wasn't just one person that was wearing it. Ha? It was like a few na nap- pansin ko. So, ito, ang first time ko makita na ang daming naka-bucket ha. Tapos, ganyan, ganyan na yung style na nila. <laughs> si ano, may oh, yeah, parang yan. parang TN1. Yeah, oo. Oh, oh. Si, si Alex, Reg. Alex, Kalyeha. Mm, Nagagano na rin siya. Oo, oh, oh, oh. I, I saw Alex wearing one. Pinost niya rin sa feed niya yun eh. Parang, he's doing it. Stained lang siya eh. Tapos, naka-plastic parang face shield na, ano, tinahin nila. <laughs> Sometimes they do like clippers eh, yung parang kiniklip na. Yeah, so, yeah. And then, <laughs> so, pag okay na, tatanggalin mo. Oh. And, so you could style it then. Okay, yun. So Clip people are thing. evolving like the way hats work din, na it's not just for the shade, it's for the face protection. And, and then, you know, isa pang napansin ko actually, or the masks. Mm. And how creative people can get with the face mask. Yeah. And yung mga home tahe, yung mga iba-ibang designs, embroidery, mga paintings on the yeah. mask. Well, I have this mask also from one of my friends. Uh, si Gino. Gino Australia, tsaka si Kai. So, ano, from Essential. Mm-hmm. Essential Squad PH. I think the, the newscasters in GMA and, well, wala na palang EBS right now. Are actually wearing it right now. So, so yon. Uh, recently, because they launched it with uh, different colors. So, so something that na nagiging mm-hmm. ano na is with the mask, pairing it of course dun sa kulay ng mga damit nila. Lalo na dun sa girls. Sa yeah. Mga newscaster. So, uh, it, it's something to to look forward. Well, Gino sa classmate and and GH. Uh, it's an opportunity that they saw. Uh, yeah. Ang galing lang. Parang for me. Uh, even though challenge tayong lahat, it's a matter of, uh, oh, ito yung kailangan eh. And, and basic principle, mm-hmm. it's about supply and demand. You will see what the demand yeah, is. Eh. Yeah. And the reason why we have this episode, the mm-hmm. new streetwear, is we're not saying that streetwear is actually going to replace um, a lot, but it will replace most of mm-hmm. what we will yeah. be wearing or releasing in the near future because it's imagine it's already a toxic world out there and you're still wearing clothes na hindi comfortable <laughs> <laughs> and there's, there's a reason for this Gita mm-hmm. face shields when we talk about face shields I mm-hmm. uh, ano comment mo na? I I <laughs> I love how I love how they um evolved the face shields into something that actually looks good on you na. As in, alam mo at least kita yung, de ba with the with the face mask? Hindi tayo pwede mag makeup, lipstick. 
is yeah. gonna lipstick business is gonna go out of business na pero we sa face shields at least kita yung buong face mo oh, <laughs> like the makeup the ba so at least you just the face I don't have long now pero maganda yung face shield ni Gita eh yung so, ginagamit niya oo talaga siya yun yung may ano may, may glasses ba mm-hmm. yeah may glasses yung sa ocha and dahat kita Super nice. Sayang, okay. I don't have it now. Is it locally, you ano? Know, yeah. Produced? What? Ah, yeah. Ah, yeah. Is it locally it... produced? Super dami na nagbebenta dito. Locally ba? ba? Oh. China. <laughs> China. <laughs> China. Gita. <laughs> but, ano, but I think... I think it's your local brand kasi they're pushing na ngayon yung mga, di ba, like, you have to help um one another like our friends like ah, they're selling this like yeah. like big mga clear na parang may glasses na clear yeah, and then that one mm-hmm. parang maporma oh, yeah. that, that looks cool ay yeah. makaura ka naman <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> face natin yan ay masyado lang over pero hardy di ba meron ka din na ganun na parang pero hindi siya face shield eh eye shield siya na parang sunglasses din Yeah, uh, same so, thing. Yeah. It's essential, ano rin, essential squad PH. And then this is something, I mean, the reason why we are actually mentioning also this, like what Hannah mentioned, no? for for us also, it's it's about supporting one another. Uh, of course, there are products wherein we can get the more stylish and all, but if we see a friend, if we see someone on social media trying their own hustles, guys, support your friends. There's a reason why yeah. you're friends. Yeah. I mean, there will come a time that you will be the one who's, who's going to need that support in terms of your business or your hustle. So I think that that's something that's what's needed right now. Uh, not even lang your friends. Uh. I mean, also with the local, whatever local initiative there is. Because um, we're, we're not just only fighting this pandemic right now, but we're also fighting... <laughs> Uh, the possible crisis in the economy, yeah. and yeah, it's, and it's hard to really depend on. I know it's it's really hard to depend on others, and when we say others, the other countries, uh, we, all we have are, are ourselves. I mean, this country. Mm-hmm. Anyway, I don't want to talk about that that, that portion. Okay, but going back to the streetwear, uh, with the streetwear recently, one what one of the changes also that we've seen is uh. How the styles evolve and how actually the big brands adapt to it. So like kanina nga, yung nabanggit nila Dara, di ba? Mm. It's really minimalist in a sense. Uh, from from the traditional high fashion na nakikita natin with big brands. And then right now, of course with Off-White, I mean just one print yeah. statement shirt, that's it. Uh, how do you see that being yeah. aligned with how the mentality of the society is actually? Kumbaga, Um, uh, is it because uh people or the society is being more vocal with what they say? That's why statement shirts are also in as well. I think I think it's more of like um the build up of like the street where usually it's known as comfy. So it's really not it's not really too flashy or anything. So like Tanya's brand, the yung he has his ripped clothes, but people still bought it. Maybe yeah. it's the way it's the way that people built the brand of the streetwear. You know, once you're like kind of very street where it's it looks cooler, it looks you know it looks stylish. Even though like before it like the bag before it wasn't that accepted. Like once you wear like baggy clothes, you're gonna be called like the bayan ang anin jawlogs naman yun. Like it's like that before Uh-oh. with the baggy clothes, right? So but then now with the, with the time, it's more accepted na rin na yeah. it's becoming stylish. And yun yeah, they're start, starting to add like it's a, it's a off white. Like it's simple. It's better. It's the brand. Yep. Na the the, the logo is there. But it, it made it really Balenciaga, like all those classy brands and high end brands. Like if you look at it, like there are other brand uh, clothing or local store that sells that. But it's the branding of their anyway. Mm-mm. Well, yeah, I think that way it is. That's why it's important if you ever gonna uh, make your streetwear 
brand, you have to really work on the branding itself. Because there's always going to be the same clothes or like the same style as what you have. It's just really the brand that what they buy. Mm, yeah, it's really the marketing. Eh? Uh, that's where brand management and marketing really comes into play with how you want your audience to see it. <laughs> Well, like your pers- perspective, that in general, eh? yeah, Hannah, yeah, go. they're becoming, yeah, they're becoming more creative with the like styles too. Like, meron ako nakita one time na parang nakalagay sa shirt niya, ang lapit mo, parang ang lapit lapit mo, ah. or like something oh, like that. Contraband yata yeah, yun, de ba? Contraband. Ano, what? Ang kailan? Contraband. Yeah. Yeah. Like, wow, yeah. parang, wait, parang gusto ko niya na adapting like, like some, yeah, we're adapting to it like different. Parang na pipiga niya yung kumbaga yung parang styles like to be more creative with 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 whatever like kung nasan tayo ngayon kasi we have to yun nga we have to adapt kailangan natin parang wearing it for me na parang oy makita ka nang nasa likod mo tapos nakita nung buong yung shirt mo sa likod na ang lapit-lapit mo oops wait lang sige <laughs> parang oh ma- ma- maaalala mo na oh nga pala yung social distancing <laughs> It's a yeah. <laughs> It works both ways, no? <laughs> oh. What do you get? Um, with the new style now, it's just like what you mentioned, Hannah. Galing lang no na in this in the in the midst of a crisis, pa do natin nakita yung creativity ng tao. Not only with clothes, with food, lahat na nagrobenta pero. Yeah. May, Mm-hmm. with clothes then now how everyone's adapting ngayon diba sa sa natin ma ma categorize yung tie dye shirts pwede bang sticker oh, tie dye <laughs> basta ngayon sobrang yeah. nag umuuso yung tie dye na, na top top chaka short yeah, na no? actually loungewear lang siya sa bahay yeah dino <laughs> jobos ang galing lang for me kasi ano yun ba yung dino jobos na t-shirt yung binababad sa... Yeah, yeah, yeah tapos nilalagyan ng... Oo, oh, yun, yun. Rubber? Oh, oh, yun, yun. Oh, yun. Oh. Parang DIY. Yeah. yeah, and wala lang. Ako oh, kasi gandang-ganda. Have it here, wait. Oh, yan, si Dara meron na. She has one. Sabi ko, oh. I always want to tell you guys can see the color. Diba? I mean, yeah, it's been so here for cool. like, since before pa. Pero ang galing lang din na how everything changes and how history repeats itself. Yeah. Also, bumabalik yung mga dating mm-hmm. styles and masapapagay yeah. na lang natin. Ang galing lang. I think yeah. tama lang na bumalik yung dating style kasi I'm really all for comfort. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Kahit nung college din, palagi ako naka-leggings, naka-sneakers, tapos mga parang sports clothes. Ayoko talaga ng ano, ng, alam mo yung ang init-init, dress. naka-maong ka or naka-dress oh, ka. Yes. Mahangin pa naman sa campus ng Lasal sa isang <laughs> part doon, di ba? Skirt. <laughs> Sobrang stress. Yeah, but I think, diba, like, adding on to what Gita said about how everyone's creativity is coming out in the middle of the pandemic. And I feel like it's because, you know, now, now is, like, the time, well, especially at the start of the lockdown, ha, nung ECQ pa lang, everybody's life was on a momentary pause. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, and it gave me so much time to actually figure out what they wanted to do, the things they realized they wanted to learn, or the hobbies they realized they wanted to develop. Diba? And what they can do pala, na you didn't yeah. know you can do it, pero yun pala, sobrang, na, na-push talaga natin yung potentials natin, and it's continuously pushing us also until now. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And, and, and all the industry, I think, even like the nightlife, like the bar with the live gigs, it wasn't, yeah. wasn't even a number four. Oh. Yeah. And like, they're starting like to... Streaming. You know, uh, uh, there are many opportunities na lumalabas. We didn't even know that it's possible. Yeah. No, we could do it before, the so, And you said about the live, yung live gigs na na-mention mo. Parang I remember the episode with Patty and Mark na parang ang sinabi nila, yeah, it's different compared to being in a club with the actual crowd and like really just getting, absorbing all the, every everyone's energy. Right. But at the same time, the the reach is definitely parang kumbaga nationwide what people from Dava or like international people who never step foot in a, in a club daw suddenly appreciate the music because now they know what it's like 
without having to step foot in an actual club or mga ganon. Yeah. Yeah. Well, with with, with that with that club right now, if we're talking okay, about club, so I think so, something that we are also working on in the, in the, in the near future is oh, you you will hear it first here in the new you. It's more of an online bar, an online club. So watch out yeah. for that. So. <laughs> Yeah, we're, we're we're working with these DJs as well and bringing the club experience online. Not just about streaming, but the whole club spir- experience. So watch out for that. But uh, sign me up for that, ah. Huh? <laughs> ano? Sign up daw si Gita don nakko. Oh no, man. I mean, we're, we're we're talking about a lot, not just the DJs playing. I know the DJs right now are doing their streams on their own. So, I mean, and then we are f- in, on full support on that one sharing. Actually, sharing those streams really help a lot. I mean, for for those for those people who doesn't know. I mean, when you, when you watch it, it's a matter of well, you can just stream it. At the same time, for those that are actually conservative with their social media feeds, you can share it while they're online and then delete it afterwards. It doesn't matter. I mean, it's a matter of just just yeah. pushing this reach for these people, trying to yeah support the smart support. I mean, because I understand it, and I to- I totally understand people na sobrang conservative na ayon nilang wala naman feed nila and all, de ba? Pero I mean, it's a live stream, guys. If you share the live stream, that's that's going to last for about what 30 minutes, 40 minutes, something like that, or an hour, and then after that, just delete it. I mean, for for all you know, maybe one of your friends are actually looking forward these people, and then you you help in terms of connecting them. Each other. Okay, last part for the streetwear. I think we've, we've tackled about the 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 shirts, the the caps, um, the shoes, the sandals, the slides. One thing that I'm seeing right now also is actually accessories. Okay, parang may nakita ko brochure. We're in yung mga air purifier, naginagong necklace. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. See, yeah. Yeah, gonna re- re- trying to like sanitize their phone like. Oh, oh yeah. Kaya <laughs> uh, yung parang meron daw sila na pagkasiot mo yon, uh, parang it it somehow parang medyo may konti kang loom. Oh, uh, layer na Surround ganyan. You. Surround you yeah with ions or whatever na sinasabi doon. Ah, uh, protection na. Oh, uh, well, hindi, hindi ko alam yun. Hindi ako doctor para i, I ano yan. But for some, I think that's going to be Confirm. something new. Yeah, or that's something to to look into. Kasi, uh, well, it's not limited to to necklace. Dati kasi it started like an idea. Eh. Para nakita ko sa ibang politicians yun dati. Oh. Nung, nung init, nung start ng lockdown. May ID, tas ID lace, diba? Doon nag-start. And then right now, nakikita ko siya na mayroon ng necklace. And then later on, um, what do you call this? Uh, bracelets or maybe earrings. Or, well, yeah, oh. it's something with accessories. I mean, lalo kayo girls. I mean, boys kasi hindi naman ganun ba accessories. Yan. Even with streetwear. Where, where do you see? Let, let's be foolish here. Uh, if you're going to do something like a purifier type of protection, anong gagawin niyo? Isa is. I mean, a line of clothing, like yeah. Said. The earrings. Earrings. Solid yun. Ako, ano. Or, ayan. Or like necklace. Cap, or, yeah. Tapos, may hangin. <laughs> Tapos, USB charge. Because <laughs> <laughs> ganun sa, may mga ganun sa, ja, sa Japan. Para nagugulat ako, yung tita ko sabihin yan. Ha, tignan mo to yung bagong prod, product ni ganun. Sa ko, ha? Uso pala yan, dyan. Parang ganun. He have this band. You also have the neck, parang um, lanyard. Ay, virus, na yung virus na lanyard ba yun? Mm-mm. Yan. Tapos sabi ko, baka niyan mama yan, necklace na or like earrings or like yeah. bands or something. Kasi, eh, syempre, parang gumagawa talaga sila ng way na yeah. para pumasok yung like fashion and at the same yeah. time, dapat safe yeah. din, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think, dapat no start safe. ng lockdown, I saw a lot of people reselling those here na in the Philippines, eh, yung parang lanyard. The mukha siyang ID lang, you just take off the peel and then I think it will, may wear, and may longevity siya, o, oh, antivirus na ID lace. Diba, no? I mean, for, for those na nag-iisip ng mga negosyo, I mean, kung may pang pondo kayo, ako, personally, wala eh. <laughs> 
that. I mean, that that's going to be a good business, I think, in in the next few months or maybe years, or until we really have a, a clear vaccine to this whole pandemic. So it's a matter of this streetwear uh, really expanding. At yun yung nakikita natin. Yeah. And, and with with the looks of it, na talagang how we define it as really uh, comfortable. I mean, the, the reason also why we had uh, we have Hannah and uh, Dara here on the show is it's not really just about the the fashion. Because if it's about the fashion, I know eh, we can actually get someone more of a fashion designer style, de right? But it's more of we choose the people who actually wear it. Because uh, well, for for us, it's it's more on the consumer naman talaga. Um, they can they can dictate the taste. They can be the dictator of taste for whatever fashion that is there. But it all boils down to who consumes it, and I think these two right here, the ladies right here, are very very much into that streetwear. So. Um, we're at the show, Gita. How's the new streetwear for you? I think the new streetwear is something we can all look forward to, and something we can keep an open mind with. Because start pa lang to eh. So, feeling ko ang dami yeah. pang mag emerge ang dami pa natin may kitang new styles. And I bet the human race will surprise us more pa. Yeah. <laughs> I'll that. And Dara, how about you? So, yeah. I think, yeah. Same as Gita. I think it's still gonna be, ano, ngayon parang, it's actually yung old school before bumabalik din siya eh. And like, they're adding up to it eh. Yeah. So, feeling ko, you know, it's gonna be mix and match of old school and the new styles. But yeah. Oh, yung mga bummer jackets bumalik eh, no? Ay. <laughs> yung mga bum- elephant pants. Oh. Mga elephant pants. Oh, yeah, dumaong. Yeah. Parang Problema lang. Baggy. Baggy. Oh, mainit oh, lang ma- yun. Ma- That's true. <laughs> okay. Well, kanina nga, parang... Wearing the mask kanina inside the grocery, so we go, ah, oh, bakit ba walang aircon? Pero may aircon naman, pero, like, maingit. Condensed, it's humid, condensed eh. Condensed dito, na nag-condensation dito. <laughs> sabi ko, ang ingat. So, so, bumababa yung mask kanina. Sabi ko, oh my God. Tapos parang yung mga guards, um, very hands-on sila, like, ma'am, ma'am, angat ko daw. Sabi ko, oh, okay. So, sobrang strict nila when it comes to, like, protection na... Yeah. <laughs> Eating outside na bawal. I mean, yung sa grocery, kailangan talaga may social distancing. Mm-mm. And then, ang hirap kasi, di ba, pag kumakain, and then lalagay mo ulit. And then, chinom ka lang, and then lalagay mo ulit. <laughs> okay. New norm. Yeah. New norm. Kaya, yeah. dyan, lo- dyan lumabas yung mga meme eh. Alam mo yung mga meme na nakamask yung tao, tapos yung bubukas nila yung bibig nila, tapos nakabukas din yung... Kita, <laughs> <laughs> kailangan natin gumawa ng mask na may zipper dito. Oo. <laughs> I think that's a really good idea. Hi diba? okay, guys, my business for tayo. clubbing. Oh. <laughs> diba? That's a really good idea. You heard it first at the new hue. <laughs> Whoever will do that, alam nyo na. Alam nyo na. Tayo nagpausa. Zipper, zipper. 9 20, 9.21 p.m. Charot. Uh. <laughs> Red, about you, the new streetwear. Um, personally, for me, kasi, I really love streetwear. I'm pretty sure Gita knows this, even sa dating office namin. Talagang, lang sense of fashion. Oo. <laughs> I'm there for the comfort, not for the fashion. But, um, you know, with the new streetwear, streetwear is fashion. And, you know, I think we talked about this before with the, the new runway. That's a very, very incredibly creative industry. <laughs> you know, like how they conducted the runway shows now, mga virtual runways. We talked with the models and the designers and the makeup artists and how they ran it. And yung, for example, yung, yung production ni Rahul Laurel, sobrang yeah. creative feel na feel. They, parang they almost replicated the same feel that you get from experiencing a runway firsthand in person. So to, to to say the least, it's it's an incredibly creative industry, and you know streetwear is part of that. And and daming naga evolve, and it will still continue to evolve, and it will still continue to surprise people, to amaze people. You know, um, 
I'm just very excited to see where it's going to go. Kasi natutuwa ako bumabalik yung mga old school pantalon eh. <laughs> Pwede ko na ilabas yung, yung pants ko nung ano, pagkasya pa. Nung old... <laughs> yeah, so to those who are watching, you know, check uh, Scoop Community out. Yung, yan, Dara and Hannah are wearing them right now. Their shirts and their bucket hats. Ganda nga na ang bucket hat ni Dara. Yeah. Kung nakita nyo lang guys, kasi black and white to eh, so hindi nyo yeah, makikita is... yung... It's floral. It's floral, yeah. It's floral. It's really, really nice. Kaso black and white to. <laughs> yeah, sorry. Yeah, that's a, it's a really nice uh, bucket hat. I have one myself as well. Um, and if you guys are enjoying the podcast, make sure to give us a like and a follow at Facebook, facebook facebook.com slash the new Hugh PH and on Instagram for more updates at the new Hugh PH. This episode is also going live right after um, on Spotify, Apple Podcast, and now Google Podcast as well. Chris? Well, this podcast is black and white. More reasons for you guys to check out Scoop on their website. Yeah. So at least you can see the colors yeah. there. Yeah. Okay. So, well. Unlock. Unlock the colors there. Yeah. I'm just, mm. yeah. This, is, this, is, this is more of a, what do you call this? Uh, a trial or a, a free demo, something like that. Huh? Anna, how about you? The new streetwear. Um, the new streetwear for me. Ayun, same lang sa kanila. Cause for me, streetwear, halos half ng clothes ko. I own like streetwear talaga. Mm-hmm. I love um the track pants, si mga ganon. Basta comfy ka. Never comes like wear out. Have to be comfy, comfortable kasi um like kunyari, aalis lang ako, like going going to the mall or like going to the groceries. You know, like, I don't have to think about w- what to wear anymore na parang, ah, ito na lang yung gagawin ko. Kasi, yun nga, yung streetwear talaga yung main fashion namin. As, as for us, ni Dara, kami talaga yung dalawa. Yun yung parang pinapurtay namin as um, branding for um, skittles. And yeah, I'm excited then na parang yung mga artists and yung mga fashion designers, they try to, like, collaborate with each other to like produce more product na streetwear na may design na ano yun parang lumabas the ng mga tao so yeah I'm, I can't wait na marami pang lumabas na products about yeah, the streetwear cause ako mismo parang yeah ako din yung number one fan na magiging fan nila kami ni Dara for sure <laughs> lagi namin susuotin yan pag ganun yeah. For me, the new streetwear is you. Actually, the person. It's more of a representation of who you are right now. Uh, mm-hmm. Hindi naman lahat nag-office eh. So, no, hindi lahat merong office clothes. Hindi lahat nag-formal clothes. Pero, all of us, when we go home, when we go back to our homes, uh, we wear us. Dun tayo nagiging kung the true... The true H, the true Reg, the true Dara, Hannah, and of course Gita. That is your streetwear. That basically yeah. is your streetwear. And aligned with that, uh, well, in terms of the the innovation to it, I think the new streetwear also will also adapt to this pandemic. It's going to be more uh, aligned to to how we should all look like outside. On the it's going to be the new streetwear. Well, for tonight, uh, thank you, Dara. Thank you, Hannah. Um, thank you for joining thank us you. in this episode. Uh, it's, it's been a fun night, of course. Um, may bit of delay lang, pero sobrang thank you for still being with thank us. Thank you so much for having uh, us. Kito. <laughs> nice meeting you, Gita. Hi, of course. Thank you, guys. <laughs> everyone. Or yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, any gigs? Any oh, yeah. live streams? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Saturday, right? Yeah. No, tomorrow, babe. Yeah, I'll wait. Yeah, tomorrow. Yes. We have oh. live tomorrow. And then, yeah. like, Saturday as so. well. Yeah, we'll just Facebook. keep on yeah. posted naman. Um, Instagram and Facebook. We both have like our um, our own Facebook page. Like for me, it's um Jehan Ichiko. For Dara, it's Dara Karina. And then Instagram, it's ganon then um Han Ichiko. And then official official Karina. Dara uh, official Karina. Karina And we're, we're also and um, doing live. Yes, yeah, it's, it's um 
ski fam. We have like our own like family. That's cute. Na rin. Our massive clan, yeah. Massive yeah. clan. And also, we're um, doing our live sets in Vigo. If you know that app. Yeah, the Vigo app. Vigo is a live stream app, right? Yes, it is. Parang Kumu? Parang, parang Kumu, yeah. yeah. Basically, we the same then. Parang ganun. We do our live sets there like every, almost every day. Na? Wow. Yeah, almost every day. It's okay, our like sure new work. <laughs> Yay! Okay. Sure to catch you guys. Well, um, thank you so Um, it's DKSA DJ Hana, and then for her it's DKSA Dara. We're always online. We're always live doing our live sets there. Ooh, yeah. Nice. Uh, I, I just want to greet first those who actually tuned in the stream. Of course, Jason, <laughs> Jane, Hagon, of course, Sir Ramil. Sir Ramil is always on the show. Well, Sir yeah, Ramil. Yeah, Sir Ramil, so, thank you. Thank you. So, thank you so the reason why we have New Yorkers watching and listening to us. So, thank you. Sir Ramil, thank you for supporting the show uh, since day one. Uh, Ramel de la Cruz, Juan Pedro Avila. Let's go, yata dapat to. Ha? Oh, thank you for being our top fan. Ganon, charot. <laughs> okay. And Steven Santan. Thank you so much, you guys, for tuning in. Um. For tomorrow, for you, Mood, Friday na. Thank God it's Friday. We'll have Kian and Cipriano on the show. <laughs> so we'll have Kian and Cipriano on the show launching his playlist, uh, Odd Community. So watch out for that. Um, once again, uh, thank you. Thank you, Dara. Thank you, Hannah. Gita, of course. Thank you, guys. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Ellie. Thank you, Ellie. Oh, uh, thank you, Ellie. Thank you, Ellie. <laughs> Thank you for thank you for joining us tonight. And well, as, as always, this show is not changing. There's a lot of changes out there, but this show is not changing. There are just updates, but not really a full change, a full blast. And we're going to we're really excited to announce it soon, okay? Because uh, we're working something out with with Bounce Back. Uh, but yeah. still, still going to be black and white, still straightforward. And still always in you. Good night, everyone. Good night. Good night, guys. Bye. 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 Thank you.